Hello everybody and welcome to my channel or welcome to my channel. Today we are starting BitLife Controls My Sim. What I think we're going to do for this series, because I kind of would like it to keep going, because I love BitLife Controls My Sims, I think every episode is going to be 10 years of life. And if you guys enjoy, then maybe if little Candela here has any babies, we'll continue with the season two. But that's just how I uh, see us starting. I see this challenge not really challenge but series going but um we're just gonna jump right in and i'm gonna introduce you guys to our bit life sim so here we have candela gill she was born in barcelona spain and she was conceived in the back of a limo her birthday is march 3rd she's a pisces her name is candela i already said that her father is Leo, he's a reti retired hairdresser. Her mother is Laura, she's a firefighter. And they have a family dog named Adriana. As we could see, father is pretty old. I made him mean because he has like no generosity. And um, he's old, he's retired, he doesn't have a lot of money. And then mom here is okay she's not really generous either but she has a little bit more money she's a firefighter i just put her in the detective career because that's as close as i could get and then we have our little beagle that we don't really have a relationship with because we are a baby so i just have him living in like a pretty mediocre house it was already built so um it's nothing crazy but we have mom here she's pretty cute and then we have dad Mr. Leo, old guy, he was a retired hairdresser, so I have him kind of like, I'm still stylish, can't let go of his glory days. And then we have our little beagle puppy over here on the couch. But yeah, so I think we're just going to go ahead and age up and see if anything happens. So it looks like we have a baby sister. So we're going to go ahead and and jump into the game and have our little sister be born. Gotta have them try for a baby. Not even a year apart. It's kind of wild, but okay. But we're gonna have them woohoo. I know they just had me, but it's a year later, so. And we're gonna age her up as a, to a toddler next year when she's technically three years old. But it'd be nice to have a sister close in age. So we're just gonna have them go ahead and create my sister. We're just going to go to MC Command Center, uh, pregnancy, she's not pregnant, but we're just going to start a pregnancy, and she's going to have one female, we're going to get her bassinet, and we're just going to send her straight into pregnancy, or send her straight into labor, because she needs to be born already, and we'll, uh, we'll just throw her over here in the corner. <laughs> She's not the main character. She's not as important as us. All right, and then we're going to go back into MC Command Center. Who started a fire? There's... No. Don't. Don't. Don't start a fire. She's, our, she's a firefighter. She's already putting the fire out. And it hasn't even started. What a freaking goon. Okay, you can't die yet. That's not a part of the story. Jesus. Luckily, we have enough money to replace it. Got a crying baby over here. Jesus. What a way to start the episode. Okay, well, back to what I was saying. We're going to go ahead and the MC Command Center. Pregnancy. Pregnancy phase. And labor. And then we're going to make her pop this little sink baby out. I think we'll play for a little bit on this year. Just because... You know, I want to see what's going to happen. I don't want to just rush through the 10 years every episode, you know? I want you guys to get attached to this family, love this family, care about them. So we're just going to, we're going to slow it down some. I think a couple minutes for each year would be reasonable. 
So now we have, I don't want to mispronounce her name, but I think it's Lara, 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 Le. Okay, we'll just, we'll just do that. And then game says she has dad's last name, so we'll give her dad's last name. It's not supposed to be twins. We'll delete him. What the heck? Um, how do I delete a baby? Um, um, MC Command Center? <laughs> Can't even do that. What the heck? I didn't want a twin. Whatever, we'll just age him up and then see what I can do with MC Command Center to delete this sim. Child adoption. Sure. Alright. That works for me. Bye. We, we're not giving your siblings up for adoption, but we're giving you up for adoption. Later. Alright. I guess he's gonna leave now. See ya, dude. Oh, oh my god. What the? What in the? Okay, he's gone. Bye. What the heck was that? Okay, well, let's go ahead and bond with the babies because we have a really good relationship with our parents. Okay, so after the notification for our sister being born, we got another notification that says, your mother is saying it's time for a nap, but you don't want a nap. And um, we're still in the bassinet, so we'll just take a, take a nap. Really fight that. You literally just caught the house on fire and you're already going to be cooking more food. Okay. And our dog is really vocal and just barking. I think she's here to collect her child we gave her. <laughs> oh, dog has to pee. Dog has to pee. Tell him to go outside. Oh, he cooked for everybody at least. He still caught the house on fire the first time though. Leo has good intentions at least oh my god I just looked to see how uh, her sister was conceived and she said she was conceived after a failed pullout okay I'm just gonna have her come in here and grab grab a serving I think he's hungry too he was cooking I want to like not age them up super fast because like I love BitLife series, but that's the one thing I don't like. I like having this story, but I kind of want to age up to a toddler. I think year three is when I'm going to age up to a toddler, so I might as well just do it. You know, we're just going to age up. We're just going to head age up and see what we get. So we hit age up and we got a notification for favorite activity. You're learning new things to do with your body and you're trying to decide which activity is the most fun. And I'm going to say running fast because toddlers in this game try to do that so we're two now nothing happened and we're just gonna go to three our beagle died after choking on rocks that's depressing that's really sad actually but um we're gonna go ahead and kill our dog um mc command center kill sim old age because i'm not i don't want my dog to choke on rocks at least i'm only three and we're gonna age up my toddler self did you come in here so we could both watch you die yep how dramatic how dramatic okay that's really sad music i'm, I'm gonna cry grim please don't let our little puppy go she died in the game so we have to let her die though and we're gonna age ourselves up age up don't cry you didn't even have a dog that long all right we're just gonna hit randomize because they don't really like give you traits independent sure that works with me and I'm gonna give her a little makeover real quick I don't know why they all have red hair and no I don't want to delete her he had brown hair okay whatever we'll just change your hair to darker Give her some cute little piggies. Uh, give her some eyebrows. Darker. She's already got brown eyes, so that works. Might honestly make them darker, because in the picture, they look to be the same exact color as her hair. So, uh, that's not what I wanted to put on her. That is. 
and some blush and then we'll change her outfits and we'll call it a day we'll just make it pink because I love that dress give her some pink shoes change her sleepwear of course one of my favorite onesies and there we go that's Candela I don't want to say her name right wrong but I think I'm I think I'm getting it we're all aged up we're toddler I feel like it is going really fast just because like but it's a bit light and I want to use it as like a general story but I also don't want to like be taken forever you know what I mean why is she stinky I think she needs to change her tampon <laughs> why? oh my god Grim Reaper is just hanging out with us that's cool my step, my future stepdad. Well, at least it's not our dad who died, and it's just the dog. <laughs> he doesn't even make a lot of money though, so it's okay. But um, I'm gonna let this age play for a little bit, and we'll come back in the morning when everybody's awake. Dude, is a Grim Reaper ever gonna leave? He just walked in on her in the bathroom. He is really trying to make herself himself the stepdaddy. Jesus. All right, we're back. It's the morning. We have a crying baby in our ear. Our little sim cells being so cute over here. Okay, go take care of the crying baby, please. Quit washing dishes and go take care of the baby. There's not a sink in the kitchen. What the heck? This is an EA made house and there's no sink in the kitchen. So we had a little bit of time and I kind of want to age the sister up because next year she'll be three. And then we'll have two toddlers, so I'm going to go ahead and we're going to age up again. So we're going to go ahead, age up. I'm lactose intolerant. My parents want to buy us a cat named Hector. We'll take him. And my sister is now going to be a toddler. So first things first, we need to adopt a cat. Services, maybe... hire a service there we go and then we'll let dad come in here and age up our sister because she doesn't really matter as much as us we're gonna go ahead and adapt a cat let's see hopefully they have a gray one because the cat we adopted is a gray cat and he is young I think it's so he's two years old so I think Nixon is probably as close as we're gonna get to Hector but Hector's Siamese so we'll actually get this Siamese cat Javernies whatever that is whatever close enough and we'll adopt him and her sister is just aging up in the background she's clingy she's a redhead too I don't know why they're all aging up as redheads when both their parents have dark hair I'm going to send mom in here to go meet the cat and adopt it. Give him some food. I'm just in the high chair crying my eyes out like, let me out of here. Laura has work in an hour even though she's having some issues right now. We're going to go ahead and take an anti-period pill. And I'm just going to jump into creative some really quick and give little lever here a makeover all right and we're just gonna what is he doing why does he have no clothes on what are you doing leo put some clothes on we're just gonna go ahead and hit the next age up because this family is dysfunctional oh well so next age up we got a new friend and a girl that has the same exact name as my sister wants to become my friend we're gonna reject her year five that's the only thing that's happened we're gonna go ahead and hit year six and we're gonna keep her as a toddler until year seven so for year six we started primary school and someone wants to become our friend we'll become our friend I guess I should actually age her up Whatever. we'll just age her up really quick I aged her up She's actually really smart in the app. She has 90 or 72. So we're going to head and age her up. 
and we're gonna make her neat whatever those don't really matter and now she's a, a child and she'll meet her friend at school we're not gonna age her up again until she goes to school and makes a friend but uh get rid of this bassinet keep this for her sister and then we'll get her her own little bed all right here's our little candle making her debut as a child and she needs to brush her teeth or did i brush her teeth and drink some water and bond with her cat who honestly should be older but it's okay because a thousand birthdays in one second is just very hard <laughs> where's our little sister at oh she's she's coming inside to play she's tired we'll let her take a nap actually send her to sleep and since she's actually really smart we'll have her she doesn't have any homework we'll buy her some homework and then we'll have her do her homework what is happening this game is so glitchy sometimes all right so um that was traumatizing i'm sure for the cat and for her dad's in here just probably gonna die from being too playful we're just gonna make him go to sleep we don't want him to die <laughs> it's not your time yet father i love the bit life controls my sim challenges because i feel like it just does it just adds to your game what is this kitten doing this thing is dangerous kitten hector over here is trying to kill us all right laura's almost done with her homework we just have her doing all the basic sim things we might have her it well we're gonna have her age up tomorrow after she meets somebody at school so i'm not too worried about that at the moment but yeah it's kind of boring because she doesn't have anything to do right now but it's okay dad's over here helping us with homework apparently they have a pretty good relationship so that's okay but not with like anybody else and barely with his wife if you guys have any suggestions of what you want her to go to college for go ahead and drop that down in the comments um she'll probably have a lot of options so if you've played bid life before you'll know generally what they can go for so go ahead and let me know what you guys think she should do since she's going to be so smart I'm actually going to have her in app. Um, I'm going to go ahead and make her study in the app. So we're just going to study harder. She's going to... Oh, not that. Spend some time with her best friend because she's going to meet her. And also, I had her playing with the cat. So we'll have her spend some time with the cat. And I guess like her working on a skill is like studying because she does need a skill up to level three. This doesn't say she's in school, so uh, join a career. Can she even do that? Okay. Probably because I aged her up how I did, but oh well. I feel like Leo here is bored and missing his glory days as a hairstylist. He's the Mr. Paul Mitchell himself. And now, he's living a lonely home life. His wife has a job. He spends all day with the kitten that meows too much. And his kids, which I don't really think he minds that much because he was offering them help with his homework without me even telling him to. But I still think he misses the glory days where he could cut hair like a true master. I feel like it's easier to just keep aging up. Like, I don't even want to wait for her to go to school because it takes so long. So we're just going to do it. You know? Why wait? She got four more years until this episode's over. So we might as well make them count. Mom came home from school. We're going to age her up. She's having trouble with this guy named Emilio in class. We're going to ignore his antics. And we're going to hit age up again. And we're going to go on a family vacation. Nothing really happened. Some girl's bullying us again. We're going to ignore her. We're going to go ahead and study and uh, hang out with our friend again watch a YouTube channel with her Lauren's east side sure 
And then we're going to spend some time with our little sister who we need to age up. And our cat. So we will spend some time with him. And then we'll hit level 10. We get a new friend. Sure. We're hang we got another friend. Alright. So those are the first 10 years of Kendala's life. Nothing too crazy. We are going to age up the little baby. We're going to have dad come in here and uh, make a cake. There we go. So now she's going to age up. Mom's watching her. Not very happy because she's tired. So we need to add birthday candles again. We're just going to randomize. Not island lover. Neat. Sure, they're both neat. That's okay. And now she is going to blow out the candles. And become an adult. It happened so fast. Everything is going to happen so fast because it's a bit life. But that's okay. She is now an adult. This little party and our little aged up mamacita is where we're going to end off today's episode. Thank you.